Thanks to a mix of video games and academics, Filipino-American Jared Hatch found his way into swimming and never looked back. Now at 25, he's proudly representing the Philippines as a strong contender in the 2024 Paris Olympics. Mobile journal Denise Valdesancho has the story. Hindi biro ang makapasok at mairepresenta ang sariling bansa para sa Paris Olympics 2024. Kaya sigurado ang Philippine team for swimming will do their best para sa kompetisyon. Meet the 25-year-old film swimmer Jared Hatch, ang ating pambato sa men's swimming sa 2024 Olympics sa Paris, France. Ipinanganak si Jared sa San Francisco, California. Kuwento ng atleta, hindi naman daw talaga swimming ang unang hirig niya. Tila, nagpain lang daw sa kanya ng video games ang kanyang mommy noong kabataan niya. We went to an area with the swim team and my mom wanted me to try it and she uh, she offered me to buy me video games if I were to just try it out for like two months or something. Pero sa murang edad, alam ni Jarod na kailangan niyang seryosohin ang swimming upang makakuha ng scholarship at maituloy ang pag-aaral sa kolehiyo. I think it was my best option to um, get my education. I went to, I graduated from Berkeley in 2021. Mm -hmm. And I got a scholarship over there, so I was able to get my degree. I'm the first person in my family to go to college and get my college degree. Ang akala niyang susi lang para sa kolehiyo na pamahal na rin talaga sa kanya. Pero aminado siyang huminto rin noon sa swimming dahil sa mental health problems. But you know, you put in the work, you work so hard, and I never really took the time to figure out who I was outside of swimming. When I got my degree in 2021, I just I thought I was done forever. Just... Pero hindi nga doon nagtapos ang swimming career ni Jarod. Na ituloy niya ito hanggang pag-uwi sa Pilipinas. Siya kasi at si Kayla Sanchez ang nanominate para punuan ang kota ng Pilipinas sa Olympics under the universality rule. I got a call from uh, Lonnie Velasco uh, to come back for Paris and I agreed to it. But as a kid, you know, you just kind of shoot for the stars. You just kind of I want I want this, like the craziest goal. Um, and when I started swimming, I was like, I want to go to the Olympics. You know? Pagamat malaking pagsubok ang pagpasok sa Olympics, hindi raw siya nagpakain sa stress at naniwalang kakayanin niya basta't masaya siya sa kanyang ginagawa. With this kind of level of competition, it can be stressful. It can like really break you. Yeah. I think a big emphasis is just trying to focus on having fun. And just remembering like Have fun. the feeling as like a kid, you know. As for his plans after the Olympics. I'm just taking it day by day. That I just, especially after this year, just it's a lot of sacrifices, a lot of energy. Tulad ni Jarod, let's take it day by day. I enjoy ang ngayon, and everything else will follow. Mobile journal Denise Valdesancho po hatid ang mukha ng balita.